Airbus just improved its supersonic jet. Let's check that out. In July, earlier this year, Airbus received a patent on a supersonic jet that could reach London from New York in just one hour. We made a video on that patent as well, so do check it out. The link for the video is available in the description below. This week, Airbus filed a patent application for an important improvement for the supersonic aircraft. The supersonic aircraft has a rocket engine towards the rear end of the fuselage. It also has two turbojets literally placed near the rear end of the fuselage. Once the aircraft climbs to a certain altitude, the turbojets are powered off and the rocket engine is ignited at full power, causing the aircraft to travel vertically like a rocket at supersonic speeds. Because of this vertical trajectory, the energy of the supersonic fuel is dissipated in all horizontal radial directions and does not encounter the ground. At this point of time, the turbojets cause a lot of drag on the aircraft. Therefore, flaps placed in front of the inlets of the turbojets are activated. The flaps cover the inlets, thereby reducing the drag considerably. After reaching a very high altitude, about 100 km, the aircraft curves into a horizontal trajectory at which point flaps are retracted and the turbojets are ignited to propel the aircraft horizontally at supersonic speeds. The fact that there is another parent application on the same technology, it indicates that Airbus is seriously working on this technology. So we should expect this to be in the market pretty soon. If you have solved a real-life problem and want a patent for your invention, please feel free to reach out to us. Simply visit our website patentyogi.com and fill a form to send your invention details. We will get back to you with a free patent search. Thanks for liking and sharing the video. If you like to stay updated on future technology trends, do subscribe to our channel by clicking the big red button. The ingenuity that makes higher supersonic speeds possible lies in the pair of fins situated on the outer ends of the delta wings. At speeds less than Mach 1, these fins are oriented horizontally. However, once the speed exceeds Mach 1, the fins are oriented vertically. One of the space drops designed to detect such threats detects and monitors the approaching solar storm. It then autonomously decides to shield other spacecrafts using its solar sail. 